Hey everyone, just uh, wanted to give you guys a couple of quick tips on your avioms. In case you didn't know them. First, when you finally get your mix dialed in the way you want, make sure you realize you've got this save button up here. So you can always hit this save button. And, uh, oops. I'm sorry. You hold down the save button. And then you select whichever um, channel you want to save on. I already saved this to 16. I'm just going to go ahead and hit that 16 again. Whoop. Does a little fancy dance. And then what you see is if you make any changes, like that, then you hit recall, and you recall channel 16. You see it goes right back to where it was from what you had saved. So that's important for any other changes that you make. Another thing you want to keep in mind is you have this fancy stereo placement knob here. As you go mixing channel by channel, realize that you're not only wanting to mix in volume, but you're also wanting to mix in the stereo placement. If you want an electric guitar off to the left and maybe an acoustic guitar off to the right, that'll take up less space in your ears for what you really want coming right down the center. And last but not least, let's say you got what you want up as high as it'll go, but you still need more of it. Well, what you really want to do is always start off with what you need the most. Say click, yourself, a certain worship leader or multiple worship leaders, and then mix everything else in from there so that you have these up only as loud as you need. As you're doing that, this is right where it needs to be, with your mix volume right up at 12 o'clock. If you still can't get enough of what you need, and you've got it turned all the way up, rather than turning up just the master volume, which will turn everything else up with the other thing that you want to have turned up, what you need to do is see this little option here, trim all both of these buttons. What happens is when you push both of these, everything is going to start going down incrementally by one little dot. So you'll see, I'm pushing it down, trim all, trim all, trim all. And now what you're able to do is bump back up only that one thing that you want. So if you still need more volume then, because now that's louder than all the other things, then you go ahead and crank your master up just a little louder to compensate for how everything else was trimmed. That's a really great little tip, so I hope it helps. Happy mixing.